nature shows us many examples of spirals, but they usually have the same mathematical and geometrical basis. They're all based on the Fibonacci sequence. In the Fibonacci sequence, each term after the first two terms is the sum of the previous two terms. And now here are some other important sequences. The even numbers are obtained by multiplying each natural number by 2. The odd numbers are obtained by multiplying each natural number by 2 and subtracting 1. The square numbers are obtained by multiplying each natural number by itself. The cube numbers are obtained by cubing each natural number. If we arrange a triangle of dots in this way, it will generate the triangle numbers. Alternatively, each triangle number is the sum of the previous triangle number and the present natural number. In an arithmetic sequence, a constant common difference is added to each term to get the next one. In a geometric sequence, each term is multiplied by a constant common ratio in order to get the next term. A prime number is a natural number that has only one and the number itself as factors. One is not included as a prime number. There is no formula for indefinitely finding the nth prime number although formulae have been derived that work up to a certain value of n. Pascal's triangle is shown here. Each number is the sum of the two numbers immediately above it. Each row contains the sequence of binomial coefficients needed for a binomial expansion. 